Hey guys, Will here again with Happily Ever Outdoors. So, as you can see, we actually got a little bit of snow last night. You can probably hear the water dripping off the trees. It started to warm up, and uh, so everything is kind of melting off. But I thought this would be a great opportunity for me to show you guys some products that I picked up from Mountain Khakis. First off, I wanted to say thank you to Mountain Khakis for sending these products out to us for us to test and review. I just want to let you guys know that these were provided to us at no cost. However, I am not a paid representative of the company, so any statements that I make or opinions that I express in this video are my own. Alright guys, so first off, I wanted to show you their Teton Sunset Trucker Cap. This is a pretty cool hat actually. Nothing uh, extremely out of the ordinary, you know, it's kind of your standard 100% uh, polyester uh, trucker cap. You got the webbing in the back, of course, with the adjustment there. And then you've got a kind of padded bill and a pretty well padded uh, front panel to it. Uh, but what really stands out on this thing is the design that's on the front. You can see the Teton Sunset. It's kind of purple and blue. And you've got the Mountain Khakis logo right there. I think, personally, that this is a really cool hat. And uh, like the very first time I wore it, I was going on a trip out of town, so I figured I would uh, take my mountain khaki stuff with me to uh, kind of test it out on the road. And I must have got like three compliments the first day I was wearing it. People said, man, that's a really cool hat. Who makes that? So uh, really, really nice design. It's enough to kind of pop and grab your attention, but not over the top, you know, crazy colors, anything like that. And uh, it just really kind of shows, uh, you know, that you uh, have a passion for the outdoors. So, so I really love the overall design of this cap, especially love the look of it. And I'm definitely going to be wearing this thing for a long time to come. All right, guys. So next, I want to show you another product that I am really excited about. And this is their men's rendezvous quarter zip shirt, which you see me wearing here. It comes in black like I've got on right now. And it also comes in field green. This is a quarter zip in the sense, if you're not familiar with the term, that it uh, zips about a quarter of the way down the front of the shirt. So this is not a full zipped shirt. Also, this is not a hoodie. You can see there's no pockets down here. So this is strictly a shirt. However, as a merino wool base layer, this thing has some really cool features to it. One that I love, if you can see here, is the breast pocket. It's nice that they added that. That's a great place, maybe if you want to put your wallet somewhere where it's accessible. If you had like snow pants and stuff like that on and you didn't really have a good place to put it. Maybe your ID or some cash or something like that. You've got that pocket right there. Also the fact that it is a quarter zip is nice because it allows you to kind of open it up. If you need to let it breathe a little bit, if you start getting too warm. And lastly, this shirt does feature thumb loops, which are great if you're wearing gloves because that's really going to help keep that shirt pulled down inside those gloves and keep you fully insulated. Now as you can imagine with this thing being 100% washable merino wool it's not cheap. Uh, Mountain Khakis had a sale going on at the time that I got this shirt and it was going for about $70. However the regular price is $120 right around there on their website. So definitely a premium product in terms of price and as far as base layers go but with 100% merino wool you get what you pay for and this definitely is a very high quality uh, layer. I love the fact that it's kind of a medium weight shirt so it's not a lightweight layer it's definitely got a little bit of thickness to it but it is not a heavy shirt by any means so this is not necessarily going to be your outer layer it could be um, it would be great for like camping and hiking trips uh, you know something that you could throw on at night maybe in the spring and summertime if it just gets a little bit of a chill uh, something maybe you could sleep in uh, but I primarily use this thing underneath a heavier coat as a, uh, a base layer and it works really really awesome for that if you just got a good you know t-shirt underneath and then this and then another heavier jacket over the top you are going to be roasty toasty warm and it's really great because you get that flexibility with lighter layers to where you can adjust maybe depending on your activity level or as temperature rises or climbs throughout the day that you can quickly adjust whereas if you just have one heavy layer on you're not going to be able to adjust you're only going to be able to have it on or off and that's not really the most effective thing for managing your uh, body temperature so really really great as a base layer now for the sake of absolute transparency i want to let you guys know i did have an issue with this shirt this is not actually the first one that mountain khaki sent me the first one i got i wore it for about four days and then i ran it through the wash the very first time i washed it just on uh you know cold water 
gentle cycle uh, by itself and didn't put it through the dryer. By the way, make sure you pay attention to the washing directions on this garment. But I washed it according to the directions and it developed a hole right down here. Uh, there was no snag or anything like that before I put it in the wash and it just kind of developed a hole after I washed it. Um, so that was a little surprising and a little disappointing to me. However, as soon as I contacted Mountain Khakis, they were very apologetic. They were very surprised themselves that that happened. And they immediately sent me out a replacement. So they sent me this one, the exact same shirt, exact same color. Very first thing I did, as soon as I got it, threw it straight in the washing machine. No issues whatsoever. And I have not seen, after a couple washings and a lot of wear on this shirt, I haven't seen any kind of um, you know, threads uh, fraying, any other holes developing, problems with the seams, anything like that. So I think that was just kind of a crazy fluke you know that kind of thing happens every now and then but the fact that mountain khakis they stood behind their product no questions asked they took me care of me right off the bat uh, I was really really impressed with that so that tells me that they believe in their products and they don't want to have a bad name out there so I definitely cannot hate on them once again I think it was just a fluke in the manufacturing there was just some kind of a defect in that material but they took care of it and this shirt I have now is absolutely awesome no problems whatsoever all right, folks, so let me be perfectly clear. Both of the products that I just showed you, I would definitely highly recommend. Really great hat, really cool design, but this shirt is just absolutely awesome. I've been wearing this so much since I got it. It's just a great layer. You can wear it once again by itself as a light layer, something to maybe keep you warm while you're sleeping at night camping or maybe sitting around the campfire. And it's super, super awesome to use as a base layer underneath a heavier coat. So this is a really, really high quality product. Definitely worth the money. I love the fact that for 100% wool product, it's got a really smooth and sleek kind of, you know, modern uh, look to it. Great features with the thumb holes, uh, with the quarter zip on the front, as well as the pocket. Just a really, really good all around garment. By the way, they have kind of cool placement on their logo. So they have the Mountain Khaki logo there. And there's actually one there on the shoulder in the back, uh, which is kind of unique. It's funny because the first time I put this thing on, I was uh, walked by a mirror and I saw that logo on the back of my shoulder and I thought there was something stuck to my shirt and I realized what it was. And I said, hey, that's kind of cool. That's a nice little you know, design touch that uh, makes them stand out a little bit. So you can definitely tell that they really think through their designs. They make a garment that's functional and it's very, very attractive to the eye. So very happy with those products. Last but not least, I've got one more product from Mountain Khakis that I'd like to show you. Now, I am not gonna be able to model this for you, unfortunately, because it is, in fact, a ladies product. But this is definitely one that my wife just absolutely loves. I picked it out for her. I didn't even ask her before I uh, added it to the order. And she was very, very happy with it. And this is their Women's Canyon Cord Skirt. Now this is kind of a heavier duty skirt uh, as far as the material is concerned, but it's still like 98% cotton with a couple other materials thrown in there. Part of that being corduroy. And you can definitely tell from the look of it and the feel of it that it is a corduroy style fabric. Now this is their slim fit skirt. They also have these in a regular fit and they have them in uh, a couple different colors for you to pick from. My wife really loves kind of stuff in the purple burgundy type of color range so this one was perfect for her. So in her experience, these skirts are pretty true to size. Uh, she ordered her normal size that she wears and she got it and it fit great. Now this is a shorter skirt, so it's shorter than what my wife would feel comfortable wearing just by itself. But this is a really, really great skirt to wear over a uh, pair of leggings, which is how she normally wears it. So it's definitely something, this is more of kind of an everyday garment, I would say. You could certainly wear it hiking like that, maybe if you were wearing uh, you know, some yoga pants or something like that um, underneath it, um, it might be good for that because it gives you that little extra layer of protection kind of around you know your backside and your legs. So if you were to sit down on a log or something like that, you know, whereas if you were just wearing regular uh, tights or yoga pants and it would snag and you know, or it would just uh, you know just not really protect your uh, backside. So it'll give you a little more material. But uh, for everyday wear, um, this thing is super comfortable. It's held up really well. Um, Color-wise, after a couple washings, it still looks great. And I'll show you guys, there's some pretty neat uh, little design touches to it. You can see the front button there, 
if I get it close enough, it's got the Mountain Khakis logo there. You can also see in the little rivets here on the pockets, they've got a little bison on there. And uh, you've got a little Mountain Khaki logo tag there on the back. So again, you can see a lot of attention to detail in terms of their design. Even the fabric inside the pockets, you can see there, it's kind of got a floral print there. So rather than just kind of, um, you know, taking shortcuts and making it real basic, um, they, uh, they really pay attention to what they're doing and you can tell they take pride in their product. I've looked this thing over real close and everything seems good quality, very sturdy. All the stitching on the pockets, all of the seams and everything seems great. You know, sometimes on women's clothes, uh, they go really, really chintzy, to be honest. They make them out of really lightweight materials. It's really poor stitching. I guess their thought is maybe that, you know, women's fashion changes more, and so they're not going to wear it as long. So they're not worried about it being as durable. Um, but uh, Mountain Khakis doesn't seem to have that attitude. They definitely built the skirt to last. This is good quality, um, which is what you would expect because their regular price on this is about a $70 skirt. So it's definitely uh, not cheap. But again, it, it is good quality, I have to admit. So um, this is something my wife really likes, and it definitely has us intrigued to uh, check out some more of Mountain Khaki's products. I hope this video has been really helpful to you guys. Mountain Khaki's might not be a brand that everyone is familiar with. I know it was one that was somewhat new to me, but I am definitely impressed with their uh, quality of their products. I love the designs. Again, hat is great. The women's skirt is great. But I am really, really loving this base layer. Um, wool is just such a great material, especially merino wool. You know, there's a lot of synthetic materials out there, a lot of stuff they come up with, uh, but at the end of the day, it seems like we keep coming back to those natural fibers, and wool just has such great uh, properties in terms of the amount of warmth that it gives you based upon the weight. Uh, merino wool is even better because it's smooth, it's not itchy, it doesn't irritate your skin, and uh, you just get so much performance out of uh, so little weight. On top of that, of course, wool, if it gets soaking wet, it still retains your body heat, which is where m really all the synthetic materials out there fall short because they may work as long as you stay dry. But Lord forbid, uh, let's say you get lost out in the woods soaking wet overnight, those materials are not gonna save your life. Whereas wearing wool, could make all the difference. So definitely a product that I highly recommend. I guarantee you I'm gonna get a lot of wear, a lot of use out of this thing. So I definitely encourage you to check them out. All right guys, I really appreciate you watching. This concludes our review. Feel free to leave your comments and your questions below. Make sure you subscribe to our channel and don't forget to look us up on Facebook, Twitter, and our blog.